Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord, the Lord who made heaven and earth, give you blessing out of Zion. Thus may the Lord Almighty, our God and Saviour, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end, for our help is in the name of this Lord, who made heaven and earth. As we come to the end of this day, we acknowledge our need of forgiveness. And so we say together, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. And thus with confidence that our requests are answered, we pray, before the ending of this day, creator of the world, we pray, that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. Desiring to hear from our God before we sleep, we attentively listen to his word as we find it in Paul's letter to the Ephesians chapter 1 verse 17 which says I pray that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ the glorious Father may give you a spirit of discernment and insight into the knowledge of him In one short verse, the Apostle Paul reminds us of our God-given calling. It is very simply to get to know Jesus better and better. Whatever contributes to this aim, we're to embrace all that stands in the way is to be jettisoned. And so we pray, glorious Father, inspire in us a never-ending thirst for Jesus. In being sated in him, may our longings be still aroused to seek him more and more. Ever sated, may we be ever aroused, enfolded in all things in his love. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. And so may the Lord our God Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, bless us and watch over us. May the Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. May the Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. 